morning everyone. Uh, <laughs> Frederick saying good morning. So today we're heading off to the shops to go grocery shopping. I've got a bunch of stuff that I need to get for this week and I thought that I would take you guys along with me today to go grocery shopping by my list and then I'll show you guys after when we get home what we bought for this week of groceries. I have my new shopping list here from Kiki K on my fridge. I absolutely love this new shopping list that I got a couple of weeks ago from Kiki K. I definitely recommend this little shopping list for anyone who wants one. It is magnetic which is awesome and it does come with a pen and you just obviously just peel it off just like I did with my one just then. I've actually got quite a list today. There is a fair few vegetables on my list today. There's also a fair few things that I need to get for my pantry and also for my fridge. I do want to go to Woolworths which is like my shop that I normally go to now just because they have got a lot more healthier alternatives slash like vegan stuff at the Woolworths that I go to. I will buy my fruit and vegetable from the fresh food market. We're going to head off to the health food shop and grab a couple of things there. We're going to head into the car and we're going to do this grocery shop. Back from the shops I have a lot of bags full of groceries. Literally have four huge bags full of groceries. Like all of those bags are so heavy to pick up by themselves. But I ended up going to Woolworths, the fresh food market that's like right next to Woolworths. And then I also went to a health food shop. We're gonna go through everything that I got at Woolworths first and then the fresh food stuff and then the health food shop. So to start off from Woolworths I ended up getting some frozen mixed berries because we ran out uh, last week and I really want to make some smoothies so we got some frozen berries. So I got some vegan nuggets because we also ran out of these. I'm trying not to have much mock meat anymore so I haven't bought mock meat in like almost two months. I've got a packet of these vegetable crackers. These are my favorite crackers at the moment. They are the sweet carrot ones. Also from um, well, worse, we grabbed a Almond Breeze milk and we also grabbed another one of them but in the chocolate flavour because Frederick has been asking for chocolate milk. So we grabbed them and I think they're only on special for $2. I grabbed some minced garlic because we ran out and I really wanted to make some vegetable fritters and they have garlic in them. I grabbed two of the fantastic um, oriental noodles. These are like our go-to lazy dinners. If I don't feel like cooking proper Asian noodles up, I will just cook these, put some veggies with them, some tofu and call it a day. We also grabbed some salt because our salt suspenser thing, one broke and two, uh, we needed salt. So I grabbed some salt. In the second bag from Woolworths, I have some canned goods as people say. I got some beans, so I got some four bean mix. I also got a chickpea. I'm pretty sure I got something else, but I don't actually know. No, apparently I didn't get any other canned things. So I also got some bolognese sauce. I got some frozen mixed vegetables. Oh no, I got the carrot ones. Oh, I hate the ones with frozen carrots in them. I just, I think they're just plasticky, but oh well. I got them because apparently they look like peas and corn. I got some cat food because our cats were running out of food. So I got them some chicken for them to stuff down. And I also got them some dry biscuits. Also got some tofu all last week. I missed out having tofu because Jason's not a huge fan of tofu and I love it. So I got a whole chunk for me and Frederick to enjoy this week. And that is everything that I got from Woolworths. I honestly didn't get that much because I just didn't need that much from Woolworths today. Also my hair is really bothering me because I put it on the side because my hair tie fell out. So I put it on the side because I've got really oily roots and I'm just not liking my hair on the side. I just I just really hate it. Next we went to the fresh food markets and I took my new uh, cotton bags with me. I got these for Christmas and they fit so much stuff in it like so much. 
They are so big and heavy right now and I'm so glad I took them with me. The first things I got from the fresh food market was some bananas. We love bananas and they're only $2 a kilo. I also got some broccolini because broccolini were two for $3 so we got them. I also got two avocados. Unfortunately in the transit this avocado got squashed. So this will be the one that we'll be using today. I did get a pomegranate. My sister actually got me onto these because her kids always have pomegranates. So I decided to get one. It was funny because the guy doing all my um, groceries didn't actually know what this was. So I thought it was quite funny. But in my next bag, I've got one little spring onion. I also got two huge zucchinis, absolutely huge zucchinis. One, these are going to be used for my vegetable fritters and I will probably be making zucchini pasta. So I got two big bad boys and I think they were only, I think they were only a dollar each. So I was really happy that they were. I got some celery, which you probably can't see because it's in a green bag, but I got some celery and I'm pretty sure they were super cheap. So I got some really nice good celery. I'm really glad I took this because I wasn't gonna take it. because I'm like, no, I'll be fine, I don't need it. And I'm so glad because I didn't use any plastic bags today. I got two tomatoes and Frederick's put his thumb through one. I did get baby corn covered in plastic. I probably should have got these from Woolworths, but I honestly wasn't going to get these. These weren't on my list today, but I saw them and Frederick's like, baby corn, can we have this? Frederick really likes to snack on these bad boys, so I just decided to um, get them so he can have a snack a little bit later. I also got some mushrooms, some cup mushrooms rooms just a handful of them not that many and we got some grapes but Frederick's actually not a fan of them because they have seeds in them and I didn't realize because they did say that they were seedless grapes and he don't like seeds in his grapes so he's not too fond about these grapes now it's everything that I got from the fresh food market now on to the health food shop mainly I was going to the health food shop to get chickpea flour which I ended up getting I got a, a bag of chickpea flour these were for my vegetable fritters that I keep on talking about so I got that I also ended up seeing that they had buckwheat kernels there which I haven't had buckwheat kernels in my house for so long so I said to Frederick do you want to have pancakes this week um, for breakfast and he said yes so I grabbed some buckwheat kernels for our pancakes we also got Frederick a dairy free, free chocolate milk these are so good and the place that I went to actually sells them pretty cheap so I'm really happy that I ended up getting one of these for Frederick the last thing that I grabbed was just Frederick's multivitamin. He actually ran out a couple of weeks ago and I just completely forgot that we ran out. And while I was at the health food shop, I saw this bad boy, so I was going to grab it up. It has iron in it, B12, B6, B9, B2. It also has calcium, zinc, magnesium, and potassium, and it also has iodine. So this is a great multivitamin, absolutely amazing multivitamin so i'm really glad i picked this guy up and i'm going to start giving it to frederick again today that is everything that i got today while grocery shopping it was it was a lot there was a lot here i want to get my receipts out so i can share with you guys how much i spent so at woolworths today i spent 52 dollars and 65 cents at the fresh food worker i only spent 26 dollars and 93 cents and at the health food shop i spent 29 dollars today i spent a total of 108 dollars and 58 cents which makes me so happy because normally i keep under a budget of 100 dollars. so i hope you all enjoyed seeing what we got today at our grocery shop if there's any questions that you guys want to know just comment them down below or if there's anything else that you guys want to say to us just please comment them and we will we'll chat in the comments but i guess it's time for me to pack away all these groceries before they get too hot in this weather and i will see you guys in a couple of days bye